budget protests come to a close. Good evening, everybody. Glad you could be here tonight. I'm Nicole okay. Chavez. It all began last Wednesday afternoon when dozens of UC Santa Cruz students planted themselves inside of Kerr Hall in a sign of solidarity against a major increase in tuition and planned <laughs> program cuts in the UC system. Well, this morning at around 8 o'clock, police in riot gear, they arrived at Kerr Hall looking for an end to the standoff. Police used batons to move students out. And this picture was sent to us by viewer Don Kingsbury, who witnessed it all. Erica, I get that. Viewer. That guy fucking orchestrated it. <laughs> viewer. The 70 students who were barricaded at Kerr Hall. I still haven't home, got those cones to come. But they left the administration building looking like oh, this. Our university is not disappointing and distressing to look at taxpayer supported property like this mm -hmm. uh, that, that really has been yep. trashed. The assistant yep. vice chancellor shows us around the dirty place. Oh, he says the yeah. furniture pieces that were used to block the doors are damaged. There's torn cables, appliances, and loads of garbage. Normal wear and tear issues that occur in a building, and uh, when you have a three day long occupation, you don't have the janitorial staff, the underpaid janitorial staff. In addition to leaving a sloppy building, graduate student John Kingsbury says students left scared. You know, you see uh, hundreds of men with masks and shields and batons marching towards you in the in the, in the daybreak it's it's there's something cinematic about it it's it's wrenching the police well said tremendous restraint history of <laughs> consciousness major uh, don kingsbury no, <laughs> fights. but an anthropology professor was hurt oh god he fell from the second floor railing. i saw it happen dude it was the really scary was i thought he broke his back crush and thought he had an opportunity to climb over a railing and jump down at that point, as the police kept on pressuring, uh, he fell off the railing, and there was a moment of fear, and got caught in the wrong place at the wrong time, but, but there was no... Got caught, and he got no caught, to, like they just merged to, to, to push anybody. Eric Argueta, your Central Coast News. Now, students said they're not planning to occupy any building again anytime soon, but they will continue to try and negotiate with administrators, and administrators say they will be willing to talk to students, but... In an orderly way, so he's sure. not a UC spokesperson like, says it's going to take him about a week now. to finish cleaning up. They could do anything. And the building will be closed tomorrow. In oh, more wow. local news and FAA.